guys, Smooth Comics here. Today I'm going to be finishing up an old work. This is Chromazone. Chromazone is the rival character to switch to Gender Ninja throughout the series. This is the show. This is what the character used to look like. And not exactly the best. Funny thing, for the longest time, you know, there is a such a thing. There is such a thing as artist hindsight, where an artist suddenly realized something that they should have done a long, long time ago. You ever had that moment you should have done something? There's, a, you, there's something you should have done a long time ago, but you're just figuring out now. Like, this was the old design. I don't know. This is the old design here. I wanted it to be multicolored, because that's my, that's my style. I like to repeat the same color over and over. Now I'm realizing that this should be a dark red. It's In hindsight, it was obvious the whole time, but I'm just realizing it now that I should have done that. So, switch. So, this is Chromosome. Their whole backstory is that Chromosome was an, a gender shifter, an artificial gender shifter created to kill Switch to Gender Ninja, but was later convinced to go rogue by Switch. Although, Chromazoe didn't, wasn't exactly a good guy. Chromazoe is the anti-hero. The Shadow the Hedgehog. This is the Shadow the Hedgehog. This is the Vegeta. This is the Sasuke of the series. And when we get into a lot of his, his powers, it's pretty overpowered. This is a world of gender shifters and all kinds of sci-fi stuff. Thing, when we get to the things that Chromazonians and gender shifters can do, especially in the later half of the series, because in the later half, that's when things always go crazy. In the later half, Chromazo and these characters are going to be doing some planet-level stuff by the end of the series, bro. They're going to be doing all kinds of crazy planet-busting and just most insane type stuff when we get to the end of the series, bro. It's going to get crazy. Tell me what you think below as I fix the design for the character. So I want you guys to tell me in the comments what in the comments what do you think of Switch to Gender Ninja? What do you think of Chromazo's design? I always here's the funny thing, I always wanted Chromazo to be Hispanic, but I couldn't get the design to work until recently. I just couldn't get it to work until just recently. I finally got the Hispanic design to work. So that's that's Chromazo just white. This is Chromazo as Hispanic finally got the design to work you want to see the male version <coughs> this is the that's the boy version of chromosome that's the girl version of chromosome so chrom see chromosomians and gender shifters in this universe they can manipulate their biological sex and use it as a deadly form of martial art they can also control various elements of their biology to use all kinds of stuff these things, those symbols, they can manipulate the gender symbols and use them as weapons to hit people. They can cut through anything unless they have a resistance. Yeah. That is a transformation. This right here is a transformation that Switch can enter into, but he gonna, he's going to get it way later on. going to explain that later. See you guys later. Like, subscribe. Tell me what you think below.